I feel um, very excited. Um, I thought the first round, um, you know, the first time that you meet an orchestra, it's like meeting a new person and you're not sure how it's, it's going to go. And I thought it went really well. So I'm mostly um, excited to uh, have another opportunity to work with these musicians and on um, this great music. Um, I thought it, 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 was, it was fine. I, I went in really with the intention and the mindset to, um, to have a great um, time performing this great music with these musicians. And 13 minutes isn't a lot to get to know an orchestra, but it was enough to, um, to really enjoy that time and look forward to uh, tomorrow. Well, I'm happy, but at the same time compromised because now I'm continuing. So I'm happy to, to be in the second round, yes. The, the timing went out really fast, but well, the, there was just 13 minutes. I think never is going to be enough to show what, what you want to show to the orchestra and to make the music better. But I, I felt really well. Um, well, I, I passed to the second round, so. Uh, yeah, I feel very excited and uh, today we worked really well. Uh, although I'm the last one, but I can still feel the musicians' support, so I feel really good now. Yeah, I think Mozart, I got the most of what I want, the Mozart elegant sound and all the phrasing, and I think we rehearse uh, a little bit more, uh, and uh, I think it's fine, yeah, today. I I'm very happy, yeah. I feel very excited to be in the semifinals because all three of these sessions are such exciting pieces of music. I'm really excited to keep working with the orchestra and working in this particular repertoire. Stravinsky is one of my favorite composers, so getting to do that concerto for strings with the Hong Kong Sinfonietta was so much fun. And the Mozart, we actually got to explore a little bit together through some rehearsing, and we started molding a little bit our particular way of playing the Mozart. So it was a very fun experience. Well, I'm really excited, obviously. It was a um, very difficult round, I would say, because it's the shortest of all. So there was loads of ideas and uh, things that we want to try out as conductors. So um, in the end, I ran out of time, which is, um, yeah, but I think all of us uh, a little bit, because we want to um, change so many things and to project our ideas to the orchestra so uh, yeah it was exciting I'm very happy with how I did and uh, I really look forward to tomorrow and the day after. I must say I feel very happy it was a little bit scary perhaps to feel to think that we could travel 13 16 hours by plane and then not get to the next round so actually very happy to be on the semi-finals. I think the performance today in the first round was really good, especially because I found an orchestra really responsive. James, the concertmeister, was there to help in every single little information we gave with the, with the button. And I felt, I felt very, very comfortable, which is not the usual thing in your very first five to ten minutes with an orchestra. Like I said, a little bit hungry, yeah, but still I feel thankful. But I think all the candidates are the great conductors. To the next round doesn't mean we are better conductor, but luckier conductor, I will think like that. Well, I'm the first one. So I wake up really early and uh, Stravinsky is not a piece you want to do it as a first thing in the morning. So a little bit nervous. Yeah, and uh, I feel Somehow I feel exhausted after conducting Stravinsky, but maybe it's the reason I think morning, the first piece. Uh, I'm happy, I'm very happy. I'm very happy, just a uh, little bit stressful because it's, uh, it was a difficult day, but uh, I'm looking forward to tomorrow. And, uh, I'm very waiting for tomorrow. It was okay, but you know, uh, every first round is very stressful, so even you, when you conduct, after you, you you, you can't remember how it was, but I, but I hope it was okay since if, if, I, if I passed, so it was, it was okay.